Hi everyone, welcome to the first week of Choice Boards. For this first week, we are going to start an origami series. So every week in art, you'll get a new origami option. And today's is a very simple, very first one called a paper airplane. To start, you're going to want a fresh sheet of paper. You're going to make sure that it's turned sideways. So look at mine, so it's longer from side to side. And then you'll fold it in half, so it's nice and long. Every time you fold something in origami, you want to be as careful as you can and do it as neatly as you can. It will help it be easier. Now that it's folded in half nice and neatly, the line is super crisp at the bottom, I'm going to take the top corner piece and I'm going to make it become even on the bottom with my bottom piece. So it kind of makes like a little triangle flat. So now you can see, now that I've creased my line really nicely, it makes this little triangle and it lines up with the bottom perfectly so it doesn't hang over the edge, it touches that line perfectly. I'm going to flip my paper to the other side and I'm going to do the exact same thing on the other side. So now I'm going to have two triangle flaps, one on either side of the paper so that they line up and it makes a shape that kind of looks like a rectangle with a point at the bottom. Okay, now we're ready to go on to the next step. We're going to take the top corner where our triangle kind of starts at, and we're going to fold that down so it's nice and flat, just like we did with the last one. It's going to fold over the top of the triangle flap and be even with the bottom. Remember, we don't want it hanging over the edge or leaving a bunch of room, we want it to all match up really nicely. So now we have that on one side and we're gonna do it on the other. So we take our triangle flap, we fold that triangle that we just made again so that the bottom line lines up really nicely with the bottom part of our paper airplane. And we do our creases really nice. So now we've got some like bigger triangle flaps and guess what, we're going to do it again one more time. So go ahead and fold that over. This is gonna start getting tricky because it has so many folds. Take your time doing it. Make sure you have it in the right spot. Make sure you make a really nice crease, line it up on the bottom. Then you're gonna flip it over once you have that the way you want it and you're going to do it one more time. Go ahead and make that crease, especially at the tip. It's gonna be a little tricky to fold, that's okay. Take your time. Put your crease in, and there we go. We have a paper airplane. You can flatten out the sides of the wings. On the bottom, it should look like this. It's got a place that you can hold, but if you kind of unfold it, you can see all those little flaps that we made in the middle. That's where we hold our air paper airplane at, and then we can fly it. Nice work. 